this is John from Astro Studios. You're listening to Galaxy Drums. From the fine folks at Space Cabin Audio. Stay tuned for my top six reasons why I use Galaxy Drums. This is Galaxy Drums by Space Cabin Audio. And in this segment, we're going to cover reason one why I use this drum VI. Reason one, the stock plugins. Now, before I start to get into the stock plugins, I just want to say that if you don't use any plugins, the drums sound great right off the bat. They are processed, but they're not overly baked, which means there's still a lot of room for you to create your own sound. Now, if you look over here on the mixer, where it says insert, the very first insert slot on every single one of these tracks is dedicated to the stock plugins that come with Galaxy. You have seven plugins to choose from. They sound great. They're not fancy in terms of graphics, meaning that they won't be CPU intensive. So let's go have a look. This is going to be the frequency I choose. I'm also going to add a compressor by pressing over here. And now the cool thing is if I want to put the compressor in front of the filter, all I got to do is just click on it and drag it in front or bring it behind. And you can do this with all seven plugins that come stock with Galaxy Drums. You just choose the signal chain in the order you want. And now let's go have a look at reason number two. Now oh, this one is amazing. The ability to use third-party plugins within the Drum VI. Meaning you don't have to bounce the audio anymore. What you can do is use your secret sauce and use your signal chain right into Galaxy. Now, remember how I told you the very first insert slot was dedicated to the stock plugins that came in Galaxy Drums? Now, the second, third, and fourth are for whatever plugins you want to use. So right now I have Cakewalk's uh, version of the LA-2A and I have it on my snare drums. So I'll stop talking, let's go have a listen. So let's choose another one. Uh, let's go here with um, JST Clip on the snare, which is a go-to for me. And uh, what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to put it where I usually tend to start off with. And uh, let's go have a listen. Now, I can choose any of the plugins here on my list, and it works in Galaxy. What you do is that there's a function where you get Galaxy to scan your computer for the available plugins on your computer. Whether you're using AU, VST, it works. If it doesn't work, what happens is that Galaxy will put it aside in a folder saying that these plugins are not compatible with it. So you won't have to worry about those plugins crashing your session. All right, let's go have a look at reason number three. One of the things I love about Galaxy Drums is that it's easy to use, it's not overly complicated, and it's very intuitive. I'm gonna show you one of the things that kind of makes this really easy for songwriters. If you don't know how to pan your drums, whether you want a drummer perspective or audience perspective, right over here, you have the letters D and A. So D for drummer and A for audience. Right now we're on audience. If we look here, everything is the same color as the the letter A. If we click on D, it goes blue like the letter D. So that's a very quick way for you to know, just looking at the mixer without having to toggle between both of those, whether you're in drummer perspective or audience perspective, which makes this really easy. Here in stage view, if you use your cursor and glide over the different instruments on your kit, you'll see a dialog box at the bottom left corner. So if you're not sure what snare you're using, just gliding over, you can find out from what preset and what kit it's from. You can also find out where it's mapped. So if you're bringing in drum grooves from a different company and things are mapped differently, 
this is a really quick way to find out where things are mapped to. If the symmetry of your drums is something that's important to you, in Galaxy, you can move the kit around, make it look as pleasing as you want, set everything, you go back and hit that preview button, and there you go, problem fixed. One of the great features in Galaxy Drums is that we can build our own kit with elements from the different kits available. And if you like the kit you just built, you can go over here to save preset. And this is gonna be your drum. This is your custom drum that you just made. I'm gonna name this Demo Drums 01. And I'm just gonna save. If I go back over here, now you're gonna see the, the preset I just created. If I go load preset, brings me to this window and right over here at the beginning, that's my preset. That's the one I just created. You're gonna see in this folder, I have other presets I have created for other sessions I've worked on. And there's this blue folder right over here. Those are the presets that come from the manufacturer. All these sound fantastic. I usually just load one up and build my own custom preset from one of the basic presets that come with Galaxy Drums. And finally, reason number six why I use Galaxy Drums is because of how it sounds. It's by far the best drum VI I own. I also own some tune track stuff, get good drums. They're all awesome, they all sound cool, but this resonates with me. Have a listen to this. Great sounding cymbals and toms. So if I wanted to, I could change the snare from that window over there. I just select it and it's gonna load up. Now let's say I change uh, this right over here. So I'm gonna use the other available ride and as it's loading up, we're gonna go back to the edit window. I wanna show you, I have an entire song written. This is the MIDI track for my drum kit. And I want to play this drum without any other music. We've got the blue track and the green tracks. That's my bass and guitars. And I want to play the kit on its own. It's bone dry. Let me prove it. No third party plugins or no stock plugins. This is just one of the presets from the manufacturer. It sounds fantastic as it is. So for you songwriters, this is what this drum can sound like in your productions without any plugins. <laughs> Okay, so you get the idea, right? It sounds killer on its own, but you're probably wondering, so why is this more tailored towards songwriters? You don't have to be an audio engineer to make this sound great. Load up a preset, and this is what it sounds like. In most drum VIs, if you want to get realism out of your tom fills or more complex part, you will have to finesse it by playing with the velocities, but that's not an issue in Galaxy. enjoyed today's overview of Galaxy Drums. I'm going to have a more in-depth video coming up really soon. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more content from me, just subscribe to the channel to not miss a single thing. And if you want to know more about Galaxy Drums and Space Cabin Audio, there's going to be a link in the description below. If you want to know more about Accent Drums and uh, Platinum Samples, there's also going to be a link in the description below. Stay tuned for more videos.